When we entered into the, the, the climate space and we looked in great detail at how the circular economy can help us to tackle climate change, it really struck me that so much of the climate conversation is about switching to renewables and energy efficiency, which is obviously absolutely vital. That we, you know, we understand that, everybody understands that. But then there's the kind of the 45%, which is about how we make products, how we use products. That could be, you know, cars or phones or food systems. They have a massive implication towards climate change. And yet, in the conversation, that, that part doesn't seem to be illustrated as well, particularly at COP26. Do you think it's there enough? No, it's definitely not there enough. And I am, you know, thoroughly delighted that you all um, are pushing on this because to be perfectly honest, um, we are still at the point in which most of the effort and most of the focus and most of the financing is going toward how do we produce X? How do we produce energy? How do we produce transport? Um, how do we produce food? And so we're still very much caught into this linear thinking and still uh, caught in chapters one and two of that linear thinking, right, which is extraction and use. And we haven't closed the loop to figure out, and then what happens? Once you produce the solar panel, once you produce the, uh, the wind turbine, once you produce the electric vehicle, and then what? And it's that and then what that we're not focusing on yet, right? We're going at this and addressing climate and emissions very much from a linear economy perspective without fast forwarding or thinking to the end of that linear and then asking, you know, the very difficult question, then what happens? And then we're surprised, right? We're surprised when somebody comes up with saying, well, then, you know, when you produce all of these EVs, then the batteries that, you know, we're going to have to discard, here is the environmental, you know, damage from those batteries, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Well, why didn't we think about that at the very beginning and design that differently?